What's happening? We all keep pairing Matang with Dialga. Well, today we're gonna have some fun with Reverum. Let's go to the deck list. All right, so we have Reverum EX. It's got its tune-up ability. You can put up to four tools on it all at once. Now that we don't have to worry about Path to the Peak, it can never get shut off, but yes, we do have to worry about Lost Vacuums, but honestly, how many decks play them? And if anything, they only play one. Very few decks play two. So we're gonna use Matang's ability, Metal Maker, to charge up Reverum, hopefully on turn two because you can get an attachment on each turn if you're able to get it. And then Metal Maker only needs to find one, maybe two energy. So you could start attacking, hitting for 170, but then we're gonna add some tools. First, our A spec we're gonna do is gonna be the maximum bell. Hit for 50, that means we're hitting for 220, which yes, hitting out most basics at that point, except for the ones that were at 230, 240, that's okay. We will just have to deal. But if they come back and attack and we have the Rocky helmet on, then they're gonna take 20 damage, putting that damage from 220 to 240. And the last tool we're gonna use is the Rigiband. So we take minus 30 for each Rigiband on it. And we're also gonna take minus 30 if we can get down the full metal lab. So depending on who you're facing, you could find the perfect combo for the tools that'll help you in each matchup. It runs pretty straightforward to try to make your opponent two, three, maybe even four shot Reverum. Now this deck runs four Arvin and an Evo, so we definitely wanna go second if we have the choice. So enough talk and let's go see it in action. Pidgey Charizard. Okay, here we go. Let's see if we can do this. Pidgey Charizard. All right, so we got Bidoof, we got Babero, we got Beldum. Uh, I hate to give up the Babero, but I have to Iono, right? I can put down the Varum because I can get put one energy on it. Uh, since I have it and then just Iono and unfortunately Babero's going to the bottom. Maybe we can find it after um, They already got their Pidgey. Yeah, that's good. They're definitely gonna Iono now Not that I wasn't before All right, so we're gonna do this. We're gonna get down Varum We're gonna get down a Varum. All right, so there's all all of them are in the deck. We're gonna get down a Rigiband We're gonna put an energy down so we have it and then we're going to Iono Yeah, bye bye your Pidgey now nah, doesn't mean they're not gonna have it. Oh, and I, oh my God, I, why did I put the energy down? I literally could have evolved these guys. Did not think it was gonna pop up. Man, that's awful. Oh, okay. So now what do I do? Well, if they can't find it, right? I have a couple choices. Um, I can, I, I can attach to the Beldum and then try to find no i can't do that i think i just evolve i put yeah, but then the energy okay they did not find it so that's good all right i think a radiant greninja to see what the heck's gonna happen here all right radiant greninja let's see what happens all right I do have a matang i have an energy so here's what we're gonna do we're gonna do the matang we're gonna metal maker nothing so that that settled that okay so now we're definitely going to uh so i'm gonna arvin for a nest ball and we'll get uh, the rigid band for now we're gonna do this and unfortunately i gotta survive otherwise i'm in some trouble all right so we're gonna go get down a, another beldum and we're gonna evolve oh now which which two which two because without matang but i really need this I, that could find me a matang we're gonna do this we're gonna get reverum and most importantly, a Babero. Because Babero can find me a Matang. All right, let's see what happens. I need I need to find two energy somehow, but I also need to find a Matang. The good thing is I can I can literally get rid of my entire hand if I use boss. Because the other ones are all gonna go on to Reverum. And they're gonna call their family, they got nothing. Oh, no way. Okay, so I gotta find a whole bunch of energy. Oh, there's a Matang. This is, this is a good way to find energy. All right, one, two, three. Okay, I need, I need what? One, two, three. I need to find three energy total. I need to find three energy total. There's one. We're gonna put that on there. I need to find an energy because I, I think we do play, do we play switch? I don't remember anymore. Uh, two. Now the question is, do I play a switch? 
Do I boss? I don't think I boss. Because they have a whole lot of things. I don't think I boss. So let's just... Let's just get it. Let's just see what happens. Okay, I have an Iono. But they don't have anything. Alright, so let's do this. Let's go get a... Do I want a Beldum or a Reverun? I think we're going to go with Beldum? No, we're going to go with Varun. Now, if I Iono... Let's see, uh, do I, I do I play a switch? I don't think I do. I don't think I played a switch in here. I don't. Okay, so that settles it. We don't Iono, we don't boss, we just leave it, and then we hit end turn. All right, that's unfortunate. I didn't want to take that. Oh, man, I had to put the, the dang down. Okay, well, they only got one extra card, and unfortunately, it was the exact card they needed. All right, they're going to hit out my Matang, which is actually not bad, because I have another one right and we are gonna boss one of their pidgeys and we're just gonna hope they don't get it that's because that's the most important thing here hero's cape 430 dang all right at least we don't have to worry about counter catcher all right yeah you can hit that out that's fine i mean it's not fine but nothing we can do about it and then we're gonna go get we're gonna go boss up your pidgey and we're gonna hope you don't get another one all right so here we go boss a Pidgey. Um, let's Matang. Let's Matang. We get one. So that's good. We, we, it would be great if we had two two Rever Rooms ready to go. And uh, yes, I already know I already did that out of sequence. I should have a barreled first. But the good thing is we're going to go get some energy. Uh, we're going to put that in. And we're, we, I think we can do it with one Matang. Yes, I know it was out of sequence. And there we go. All right, Rocky Helmet. Uh, we'll just put that on there. Do we want another Matang? No, I think we're good. And we're gonna hit this thing for 170. Take a lot less damage. And hopefully we find another boss. No. Okay. All right, so what can I do here? I, <sighs> Counter Catcher's not gonna be good either unless they boss me, right? Unless they boss me up. Counter Catcher's not gonna be good. Don't know if they have it in their hand. So I could, I, I think I, I Yono the, the barrel and the away and the ultra ball to try to find the other boss. I don't know if it's in there, but I want to find it. I mean, hitting for 430, that's, uh, that's pretty good. I mean, we can still two shot it, right? All right, they're going to boss, not the Matang, not the Matang, not the Matang, actually not, not the barrel. Yeah, the uh, Radiant Greninja, sure. I actually don't need it anymore. I don't. All right. So the good thing is we still have a Matang, so we're going to do all that. We're going to Matang first. There's another Matang. All right, so let's let's Metal Maker because we, we need some. We got two. All right, so we got two fully loaded. Boom, boom. Okay, so I don't even need... Uh, so we're not going to... We're going to get rid of that and that. Boom. Um, do I want a Beldum or Bidoof? Let's get a Beldum and I'll have to try to find another Matang. Are there, are there both Matang in here? There's two, so there is one prized. Fair enough. Do I get rid of the Iono? I think I do. And go get a Bidoof. Let's get a Bidoof, just in case. Actually, no, that doesn't even matter. But whatever. It is what it is. Here we go. Come on. I got the boss. Okay, that is huge. Boss, the Pidgey. Put down the Full Metal Lab. Put this down so I can retreat and hit this thing for 170. Oh my god, okay, that was that was intense. That turn was intense. Uh, I did make a couple mistakes there, right? Uh, I, I sequenced out of order, and I, there was no reason to put down the Bidoof because my one Super Rod is gone, and the B Barrel is gone. All right, so, but I have what I need. Okay, so now I can put down, oh, wow, 430, dang. That is, a, that is a tough one to hit. So I think what I'm going to do is put put the belt here. I'm going to put the belt here and then... Because I have one more gust, which is... Which is... I can't use the counter catcher. All right, they're going to... They, they got their boss. What are, all right, they're probably going to boss up the other Rever Room. Fair enough. They got the Manaphy down. Now you're making mistakes like I did. They're going to restart. Okay, that's why. They want to restart. Are you going to boss? I mean, the only thing I don't need is a, is a Batang. Actually, there is nothing on the board I need. Okay, they're, they're not. 20 for you. 
and I think in order for me to two shot this, right? What am I doing? I'm doing 170. So I think I need to come back with this. So here's where we're gonna retreat. We're gonna come up with this because you're not gonna one shot me. We're gonna put that there in case we wanna retreat. We can metal maker. There's two. So we'll put that there and we're just gonna put it on Matang. Because Matang could do 60 and you never know if I have to come up with Matang. All right, so I have a bunch of retreating options here. Did I industrious incisors? I, I don't know if I did, but I don't want to. I only have eight to go. All right, 220, so I could two shot this thing. Boom. Okay. Now they can't hit me out. They're gonna two shot everything also. But they do have a boss, right? They do have a boss. This 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 game's intense. This is this is strategy here. This is strategy here. They're gonna Arvin, because counter catcher is not active for either of us being tied. But I am about to okay so you can loss vacuum one of them sure i don't think you'll still be able to hit me out okay because we got the full metal lab all right so they're going to use that they they need another charizard do we play we don't play vacuum no that would be great actually no the vacuum doesn't matter i'm going to two shot you anyway at this point because 170 yeah i gotta not this this rev room has to survive which it is they're not hitting 280 there's no way not with all the rigid bands and the full metal and i've only taken two prize cards they're only doing 150. All right, so that one's getting knocked out. That one, ooh, I don't know. This is gonna be close. This is gonna be close. So this one hits for more, but that one has less damage. All right, we're just gonna hit this out for 220. Because I think, I think this other one down here could survive. Let's see. Let's see what we get here, full metal. Okay, so the good thing is we got a full metal. We can't counter catcher. Oh, I really wish I could, wish I counter catcher. I might, how much energy he has? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. So 11, 12. So I think, I think, uh, I don't remember, did they boss? Did they use their boss? They used one boss. Cause if they, uh, they used their boss, I could come up with Matang here and try to attack. Cause there is two energy somewhere between the prize cards and these seven. Let's see what, the, well, let's see what damage input they're doing here. 210, 210 knocks me out, doesn't it? Let me see, 210. But I have a bunch of ridge bands, so we're we should be okay. I think I think I'm okay. Because I have a bunch of ridge bands. The other one did not. Rever room. There is literally nothing. So let's metal maker? Am I missing something? Why can't I metal maker? What am I missing? Is there something that's shutting my abilities off? Okay. I'm I'm either okay. I yep. Okay. Hit for 170. Is there something that's shutting my ability off? Once during your turn, you may look at the top four cards. Why can't I do that? Huh. Stumped. Absolutely stumped. Lost vacuum. They're going to lost vacuum one of them. I didn't do the math. Can they get rid of it? Is it enough? I'm going to take 30 less damage. Is it enough? I think it is. 300 minus 1, 2, 3, 4, 1. I think, I think they have it. I haven't done the math yet, but I think they have it. 1, 2, 3, 4. I think I needed that one. I think they have it now. That would stink, but thank God I didn't come up with Matang. I couldn't. Why didn't it work? I don't know. I'm going to look back or somebody let me know in the comments because I cannot figure it out why I was not able to use Metal Maker. They must be short. They must be short. They are short by 10. Yes, they are short, which means we take the win. Oh, man, that's awesome. I still don't understand why I wasn't able to use Metal Maker. It doesn't matter. We still take the win. Whew, we beat a Charizard by 10 HP. That was fantastic. All right, Scrovit Bidoof, they go first. All right. All right, so I'm gonna have a Beldum with Matang. I got a Varum. I'm gonna be able to use Greninja at least this turn. Unfortunately, I don't have a B Bidoof. I need a Bidoof. They got Bidoof Scrovit. There's their B Barrel. So they're ready for next turn. All right, let's see what I get here. Arvin, Arvin! Buddy Poffin, Buddy Poffin actually works. Uh, Varun, because now I'm gonna get a Buddy Poffin for this. And, Beldum, Beldum, Varun, Varun. We're gonna get a Varun. All right, so I got two Varuns, I need another Beldum. And we're gonna put the energy here. We're then going to conceal cards. And we've got a boss, we're not gonna use the boss. And we're gonna, we're gonna leave it there. All right, cool. 
All right, so now, next turn, what do we got? We got Matang, Babarel, and Energy. Boom. Then I could boss, because they're probably going to try to get out of the active. And if they don't, that would be pretty amazing, because then I don't have to use the boss. Industrious Incisors. All right, Ghastly. All right, so they're going to try to get rid of our energy. So, all right. They're going to Iona. They're going to Iona. No, don't do it. Don't do it. Did they use something already? No, they're going to Iona. Oh, no. <laughs> no. No. Oh, my God. I literally had everything. I literally had everything, and they got a whole bunch of Ghastlies. Now, they probably should have gotten a Bidoof, because if I can get this off, which it's highly unlikely... But I'm going to try. Actually, no, I can't. Unless unless Greninja gives me some. I can't believe I had every single piece. Okay. So we're going to we're gonna thin this deck here to uh, a Beldum. Uh, we're going to put an energy on this Varum. And then we're, we're going to do it right back to you. We're going to hope we get some energy. Uh, just one. Just one. I don't want a lot of energy. I want it to stay in there. Cool. All right. I did get a Matang. And a Reverum. Man, that was pretty bad. Um... Let's, all right, so let's, let's put that down. Let's, let's Matang. It would be great if I got two energy. I need two, two energy. Two, two, I got one. One's not good. One's not good. Uh, let's Greninja now so I can't attack yet. Which, oh, I could have hit there, but barrel. Uh, let's get rid of this. Let's get rid of this because I have the energy. I uh, really would have liked it. Let's get a barrel. All right, now I can get some cards at least. All right, so I can attack next turn, which is unfortunate because it might be too late. All right, there's another river room. I do have a super rod, which I can, I'm can. i going to have to put energy back because they're going to get rid of a lot of energy. Yeah, that's pretty crazy. Let's do this. Pokemon League Headquarters does not matter to me. Arvin, good. All right, so no boss. So this river room is going to be able to come on up and hit... So I have another Matang, so I'll definitely be able to attack. And then get the other Rever Room. Wow. Okay. What do they have? I got an Earthen Vessel. This would be crazy if I can get this Babarel. This is a very slow game both ways. If I can get this Babarel. I mean, all I gotta do is attach and retreat. So, I mean, I, I, I got this. And I know the boss is coming back up eventually. I might... Uh, do I... Do I... If, it, if the boss comes up, do, do I just get one of the Ghastlies? All right, so they're going to do that, and nope, I think, no, I think the barrel, because that stops them from going through their deck. The barrel's too important, even if a boss comes up. Even if a boss comes up. All right, they're going to Industrious Incisors now. Rare Candy, and they got it. Do they have a switch? What's the retreat on this guy? Two, okay. Do they have a switch? They don't. All right, so that's good. So we're going to attach. I am not even going to worry about anything else. Oh! So attach from hand, I remember now. All right, so Matang, which is good because now we're going to Metal Maker. One, since that's not from hand, that doesn't count. That's fantastic. Metal Maker, I'm gonna try again, come on. We got one, very good. And now I'm going to retreat. Take out your, okay, well, how many energy I got there? Three? Yeah, we're, we're gonna play this. We're going to get all three back because we need that energy. And now we're going to Industrious Incisors for three. I do have the Rocky Helmet there. Uh, do I want a Greninja? Yeah, because I want some more. I definitely want some more tools. Don't have anything, but I can counter catch her later. Cool. Took out your Barrel. Whew. Okay, now they're going to move some energy. And they're going to move it to Barrel and everybody... Right? Because that's what they do. They move the energy. Whenever your opponent... You may move an energy from your opponent's active to one of your bench. Alright, so I gotta kind of save these energy. They're obviously not going to put it to Rever Room. Pokemon League Headquarters. Okay, I got... I got a Varum Arvin. Alright, Arvin. What the heck can Arvin get me at this point? I'm pretty much... I'm set up. Well, Arvin can get me another tool. Alright, Alakazam. Alright, so they're going to try to take out Matang... Right, you're only hitting 100, so you're three-shotting me. If I can get, which I am, I'm going to Arvin for some more tools. So we're good. You take 20. All right, this is this is an interesting matchup here. All right, so I'm not going to get rid. I, I need to save the energy. Ooh, that's that's going to hurt. And 
Okay. Arvin 4 Rigid Band and Ultra Ball. Okay. I'm gonna I'm I'm gonna leave it there. Let's uh let's metal maker nothing. Cause I need to get this energy on Rever Room. I gotta make sure I get one. Alright, so they can move it because I know they're not gonna knock me out. Got the Rigid Band. Alright, hit for 170. Where uh, so and the good thing is they have no more engine. They got stuck. And we're, we're, we're going to take them out here. And they're going to three-shot us here. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And because they can't knock us out, they're never going to take prize cards. They probably should have moved the damage. Yeah. No, they should have moved the damage to the Rever Room. Because imagine if that 40 was on the Rever Room. They'd be that much closer. Because now they only hit me for 70. So they're going to have to four-shot Rever Room. And yeah, you can move it to the tank. I don't care. I mean, they're probably going to counter catchers what they're waiting for. Uh, I'm going to hold the energy and I'm just going to, well, you know, you know what? I'm going to do this. I'm going to go get another rigid band. I'm going to get a nest ball. So they're only hitting me for 70. So I'm going to put that one on there and we're going to, yeah, we're going to hit. Yep. I'm going to confirm. I'm hitting you out. Here we go. Taking the knockout. All right, we got two. Oh, the counter catcher's already active. I didn't. Really, I forgot we took. There's the maximum belt. Whew, could have used that. All right, so they are. They are definitely. Um, they're, they're doing. They're doing nest dash for one, hoping it's a supporter. That's a bit rough. They're gonna crushing hammer. Okay, fails. Good. And what? Are, I mean, at this point, we're just. They're gonna painful spoons. And they they just keep going to try to take out my mate. I mean, I, I guess yeah. Because then I have to do that, but uh, yeah, we're just gonna we're gonna put the maximum belts in case they turn into a Gengar, and we're just gonna take one prize card at a time. Uh, yeah, four. They were gonna have to four shot Rever Room. There's another Rever Room, so we're good. Here's Ghastly. Uh, they're waiting. They're they're getting two cards at a time. This is uh this is rough to and okay. There's an Arvid. What do they get? What do they get? They gotta get something to draw more cards. Meaning, uh, Nest Ball? Nest Ball or an Evolution? Counter Catcher Evolution. Alright, so they're gonna try to delay. They're gonna try to delay, but the good thing is I can attach, retreat, and then take the knockout. Alright, there you go. They're trying to get... See what they're doing. They're gonna Counter Catcher. The Matang, which... Okay. Because I'm just gonna hit, hit it with the Matang. That's all I'm gonna do. I'm not gonna even waste my, uh, retreat. So my two Matangs, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm just gonna make sure I don't lose this. All right, Metal metal Maker. We got one, boom, and Metal Maker. One, cool, and there we go. And now we are going to attach and then just hit for 60, take the knockout. Excellent. One more knockout and we win. Let's see if they try to counter catch her again. Well, the good thing is everybody now has an energy so I can actually, since I have the energy in my hand, uh, yeah, knocking out the, the barrel in the beginning or what, the beginning towards the game was absolutely amazing. That, that kind of won the game right there. They are going to finally take a prize card by hitting out of Matang. And let's see what that prize card is. It's a Narvin. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what they're going to get. Uh, this is just a matter of time. I mean, they're they're playing through the game. So, yeah, can't blame them there. And they got a de-evolution. Fair. All right. So they're going to de-evolution. Huh. De-evolution. Uh, they're going to take a price card here. Boom. All right. Yep. 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 I mean, it all goes into my hand. I just come back up and but uh, they do take another price card. Fair enough. But uh, I just put on the Matang. Hit, hit the ghastly and take the game. That wasn't too bad. There we go. And let's just, come on, oh, give me my win. There we go. All right, they finished the game. Can't blame them there. I probably would have conceded way before, knowing knowing that it was over. Okay, Charizard, here we go. Here we go with Charizard. Okay, the uh, problem's gonna be the Radiant Charizard if they got one. All right, uh, we do have an evolution, meaning I can go get a but dang. All right, with a buddy puff. Okay, all right. I'm a whole bunch of energy. All right, you're getting there. We're doing that. We're doing this. We're going to go get... 
We've got a Bidoof, assuming it's gonna get knocked out. I need a Varoom and a Bidoof. We're gonna get one of everything down there. And we already got that, so we are going to Iono. We're gonna Iono them there. Yeah, they're getting six cards too. Okay, now the cool thing is we have now Greninja. And then I can get one more of a room. And I can have a barrel. All right, so we'll hit the evolution. Here we go. So I have the barrel. So we need a Matang and a Varoon. Or a room. Boom. And boom. That's a heck of a turn. That's a heck of a turn one. And I got the barrel all set up. Would be funny if... Well, if I don't get knocked out, right? I would have to... Okay, so they Arvin. Assuming I don't get knocked out... um. I put the b barrel. I can't use the buddy poffin. I put the metal lab. All right, I'm getting knocked out. That's for sure. Infernal rain. All right, so they're going to infernal rain. I'm definitely going to get knocked out. They're going to retreat to Squovic, come up with Charizard. And now I just need a bunch of tools. So Charizard has to three shot. And we're only we're going to two shot it. So let's let's see what we have. Ultra bolt for your b barrel. Oh, they had a D evolution and evolution. And there's the barrel. Okay, we got we got one too. Because you are Vin, so we're not. Can't counter catch her. So we're good there. We are totally good. Burning darkness. Take your one. Alright. Now we gotta try to get them as quick as possible. I mean, right now they're gonna two shot us. Let's let's try to make it three. Let's try to make it three. Okay. So I wanna thin the deck as much as possible. So we will get we have a Varoon. We got the metal lab. So I don't need to do that. So let's let's industrious incisors and hopefully it's not energy. It's not. That's fantastic. Okay. So I, I can't matang. I don't want to get. I really don't want to get rid of anything. We need three energy or we're done. Oh my god! We only got one. That means we're gonna take a hit. Um. Yeah. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna retreat into the Varoom because I can always get it back. All right, so that's what we're going to do. That means there's a bunch of energy still in the deck. How much energy here? Two. Okay. So there's two. So I could super rod two of them back in to give me a better chance. Although I did Matang. So there's technically only 28 cards. Because we know the bottom four are no energy. So there's 10 cards out of 28. Uh, okay. Let's see what they do. They don't have counter catcher. They would have to have a boss. And now I'm... Oh, man... Oh, they're going to boss my Greninja. Okay. Do it. Okay. That actually is not that bad. Because I can go put this Matang down. Go get... I could super rod that and get... The, okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We're actually really good. We're actually really good. All right. So, I am going to... Metal Maker. I need three out of the next eight cards. I got one. I need... Well, nope. I, I need one out of four now. Here we go. I need one out of four because I have one in my hand. Come on. Seriously? That's insane. All right. Super rod. You know what? I should have super rotted it back in. Maybe I should have super rotted it back in. Do this. There we go. Go get Greninja back. I mean, I, I have, I'm flabbergasted. Put this down. Go get Industrious Incisors. And then we're going to give him one more. Um, let's, let's, let's conceal cards. I did not get... So I, I do have another Rever Room. Or do I just give him one? I think because they did waste a boss. All right. I think we're going to give him we're going to give him Varoom again. Arvin. I could counter catch her. Ooh, maybe that would have been a better. All right. So we can actually get this down. We can get that down. We can get that down. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Um, I could boss. Let's let's boss up the barrel. Make it a little difficult. Because worst comes to worst, I can just river room. Okay, so that's what we're gonna do. Wow, that was uh, that was a lot of work, and we got nothing out of it. Let's see. They have a rare. Okay, so they're gonna. Well, they they would have to put bolt two energy on the barrel, or have a switch, and then this other Charizard they'd have to find an energy at some point. Yep, that's what they're gonna do. I mean, it makes sense. Got it. And there it is. Oh, the other one is in their hand. Oh, that means that means they have some prize. Ooh, of course they're gonna pull it now. All right, Ultra Ball four. All right, so they're gonna do their little Squovit, the barrel, the barrel Squovit, the barrel engine. 
Okay, fair enough. Barrel. All right, so they're going to see a lot of cards every turn. So now the question is, they're going to Arvin. What are you going to Arvin for? Pa, Super Rod, they need energy. And then, we uh, little Pokemon. Nope, nope, do we? All right, so we have one more Varoom somewhere. They're going to Prime Catcher after all that? Well, you can't Prime Catcher right now. Okay, so they're going to Prime Catcher something. All right, come on, Matang. Don't let me down this time. Come on, Matang. All right. Metal Maker, Metal Maker, Metal Maker. Boom. All right, so we can finally attack. Um, let's, let's Industrious Incisors. Okay, Nest Ball. I don't want to build them. Oh, that means the other one's prized. Okay, and we already used this. Okay, we're in some, we're in some trouble. All right, let's Cypher Maniac. What do I need? What in the world do I need? I'm going to need a Niono. Although that's not going to do anything, is it? Let's get that. How many tools do I have on me? Yeah. Okay. So the most important tool is that. And let's get counter catcher. I'm going to keep those are going to be my next things. I'm not going to use that. All right. So we're going to hit this thing for 220. And then hopefully they have to three shot. Let's see. Let's see. They're going to buddy poffin. Because I have the river room. So basically I have to, if I can survive, but they do have counter catcher. So if I, if I can survive, Burning Darkness is only 90. Okay. That means they're going to four shot. And we're going to knock this thing out. And we're going to get that. I'm going to be barrel because I want the next one for counter catcher. Excellent. There's really nothing I need right at the moment. So we're just going to take two prize cards. Yep. There's not, I have everything in my hand. We are just going to, all right. So there's one Jarzar down. Go right down the middle here. Oh no, I don't have it. All right, but now they hit, now they hit for harder. All right, but I'm going to counter catcher and I'm going to try to hit this Charizard. Because now, now they hit for harder. Ooh, there's a Charmeleon. They're going to prime catcher. Fair. Honestly, the only thing that would hurt, actually nothing. The only thing that would hurt is Reverum. Okay. Unless, unless they have another boss after this. Then, yeah, then they win. Okay. Charizard, oh, Radiant Charizard. Oh, man. I mean, I could, I could try to knock that out with counter catcher. Let's make it a little more difficult. Okay, they're gonna Iono. Okay, okay, okay. All right. So we get four. There's really okay. I, yeah, the, the Varoom being prized is absolutely awful. They're gonna Nestash, Industrious Incisors. Okay. So there goes my counter catcher. Uh, Burning Darkness because they're gonna. Well, they they can't charge it up, can they? All right. Let's see. Let's see what we get here. Because now everything went down to the bottom. Tang, um, Ultra Ball. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna hit for 220. There is absolutely nothing for me to do. And then I'm gonna hope. Oh, because then Charizard, they still have to get two energy on it. No, only one. Let's see if I can get a counter catcher. Because if I can find the counter catcher of the Arvin, and it only take one prize, which would be the Radiant Charizard, it actually wouldn't be too bad. I think I'd be able to survive. I don't know. Let's see. Let's see the math here. I need this to be, well, I need it to be like, no, I don't know what it's going to, what, what it's going to be like. Now, the cool thing is they're going to take some damage themselves. All right. They're going to super rod some energy back in and the Charizard. They've already squoved. Can't nest dash again. You can get one card. Okay. Now you can get two. Yeah. I think my best bet is to try to get this Charizard. Otherwise, the Radiant Charizard just comes, hits me for weakness and it's game over. And actually isn't a game over no matter what. I think I'm just, I think I'm just caught in the middle here because the, the, my Varoom, um, it is, it is what? 90, 90, this would be a hit for 60, 70, 80. Uh, I think I'm just dead in the water. Well, let's retreat and come up with the barrel. Why not? Let's do it. Let's try to knock out this Jarzard. I think this is our only option. Okay. I think this is our only option. We got two. No way. Okay. 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 Tail smash, baby. This is our only option. We're going to tail smash and we're going to, we're going to hit heads. Come on. Come on. Yes. We knocked it out. Okay. We took two prize cards. We need a Varoom. Now, if they get a boss, they get a boss. It's nothing we can do. We got the Varoom. Okay. Now, if they boss, that, that would just stink. Opponent's turn. Let's see. 
Are they gonna boss right away? Are they, they come on? That was just gaming's false hope. Unbelievable. River Room's one of those decks that are really fun to play. Why not get it when you're able to get it working? I'm sure there's improvements that we can make to this deck to make it a little more consistent. But I had fun playing it, and I'll see you next time.